Alright, there's our tower. You really think all that treasure's gonna be just sitting in the middle of a goddamn market? Oh yeah, that'd be crazy. <laughs> but we've seen crazy before. That we have. Coming through. get this? Uh, friend, that is a very unique item. I'll give you a discount. Five hundred dollars. <laughs> are you kidding? I don't even know if it's real. I'll give you fifty bucks for it. Four hundred dollars, and it's real. I don't know buyers interested in that piece. Come on, man. Uh, Two hundred, okay? That's all I have on me. I cannot possibly part with it for less than three hundred. That is my final offer. And I'll take it. 300. Nate, really? Done. You see that? That's how you hack. <laughs> if you say so. Excuse me. <laughs> okay, fine, fine. Here. Oh, thank you very much, sir. Enjoy your apple. And tell your friends. It's a lemur. Come on, come say hi. That's all right. <laughs> so cute. Whoa! Hey! Hey, Sully! <laughs> hey! He stole my apple! Can't trust anyone these days. You know what? After this is over and done with, I'm gonna get a dog. Gee, if we come out of this in one piece, I'll buy you the damn dog. Can I name it Victor? <laughs> sure. Hey, Nate. Want me to buy you one of these? Sully, you gotta be crazy to wear a shirt like that. Ah, crazy handsome. Oh, man. Something smells really good. Right. It does smell good. Oh, look out. Excuse me. Hey, here we go. Locked. I guess we're gonna have to sneak in. Discreetly. Implied by the use of the word sneak. So. Check it out. That window over there is broken. Hey, Sully. I think we can squeeze through here. That'll work. <laughs> Jesus. Long way down. <sighs> you okay back there? You keep your pace. I'll keep mine. Yeah, well, at least you got a great view, right?
Okay, let's see what we got. Wow. This place is in much better shape than the other towers. That's right in the middle of the city. Edward England's sigil, just like the map said. So what are we looking for? Good question. Yes. Yes, it is. Hmm. Now, what do you bet? Looks like we're at the right tower. Call us. They don't have the best coverage in this city. Well, no reason to wait. I'll be right back. to get tangled in those gears up there. You bet. Fingers, Nate. Can I be nervous? No, good. Trust me. Where have I heard that before?
where is. Oh, he's nice people.
There you are. I made it! Jesus Christ. Hey, Sally. Oh, shit. At least I got the door open, though, huh? <laughs> That's one way to do it. You all right? I don't know yet. You? Deaf? Come on. Let's see what Avery has in store for us. Sure, why not? Let's see what's down here. 
Fingers crossed for piles of gold and jewels. Sam, finally, you okay? Just search my towel. I, I got nothing. Yeah? No. We're definitely in the right place. Make your way over here. Are you serious? Uh, okay, I'm on my way. He's coming. Good. Sully. Way ahead of you. Whoa. Hey, are those our boys? Yep. Henry Avery, Thomas too. Partners in crime. Founders. Founders of what? Worst scavenger hunt ever. <laughs> there are Avery and two sigils. These are a little different, though. Yeah, they got those star patterns on them. They turn, but which way are they supposed to go? Just a second. More pirate symbols. Adam Baldridge, Anne Bonnie, and uh, Christopher Condent. I mean, there's, there's too many permutations. I say we see where that door leads. Still hoping for some treasure, yeah? You and me both. Hey, look, I was right. Baldridge, Bonnie, and Condit. Splendid. But why are they here in the first place? Well, let's find out. Well, that mustache. It's almost as impressive as yours. It's all right. Hey, look at these stars. They're just like the ones on the Avery and Two sigils in the other room. Yeah, you're right. Ah, uh, that's right. Content went by Billy One Hand. Guess he had one made. Here's another one of those star patterns. Yeah, but this one's different than that first one. Oh, yeah. Good catch. Thank you. See, I'm not just a pretty face. Huh. Bonnie was a redhead. Yeah. What do you think? Those Avery and Two sigils. The stars on those lined up, remember? Bet these line up, too. Hmm.
That's... Um... They are, uh... You don't know, do you? Hey, there were a lot of pirates out there, you know? So we're stuck. No, we're not stuck. Would you... Give me your phone. What, you're gonna phone a friend? Close. Text a brother. There. You know, these are actually some nice paintings. If we don't find the treasure, maybe we could sell them to a museum. Let's find those star patterns. Okay, just saying. Hey, Sully, give me a hand. You got it. Thanks. Is it straight? Who the hell cares? Well, I care. God, look at Farrell's face. Looks like he'd rather be anywhere else. There. Hey, you still in the tower? Yeah, I just uh, climbed back down. What's with the picture you just sent? I'll fill you in later. For now, just tell me who's who. Well, the, the dolphins are Richard Wong, the trident is Joseph Farrell, and the two hands with the pearl is William Mays. All right, great. Just stay where there's good reception. I might need your help again. But Nathan, did you find the treasure? No, not yet, but I got a mechanism to solve here. I'll let you know. Hey, Richard Want. He was the captain of the Dolphin. Whew. Looks like he and Baldridge were in a best wig competition. Uh -huh. What is that statue holding in May's portrait? Well, the ship was named the Pearl, so maybe a pearl? Ah, very literal. Here we go.
So who do we have here? Uh... You know, I'm honestly shocked you don't know this stuff. No, I, I do. I just want to make sure Sam knows. You know, because he likes to feel useful, that's all. Aha, uh -huh. of course. 